Monday, Tuesday. Mm. All right, thanks. All right, our month-long Military Appreciation Month uh, series is coming to a close on this last day of May. KTLA 5's Gail Anderson takes us to a new exhibit at the Reagan Library with real stories and real secrets. Look at this. This is one of more than 100 real artifacts that you will see at this exhibit. Secrets of World War II at the Reagan Library. Uh, Melissa Gilley, there are, I'm learning from Melissa here, that there are real artifacts, uh, real stories, and real secrets. Melissa, one of them, wait until you hear this, has to do with these playing cards. Yeah, that's right. So um, according to the Geneva Con Convention, the Red Cross could actually deliver care packages to prisoners of war. And American prisoners of war were taught to look for playing cards by the Bicycle Playing Card Company. And if they got the deck of cards, they worked just like cards. You could play Jim Rummy or, you know, go fish or anything you wanted. So this is an uncut deck, of okay. course. But if you submerged the cards in water, the blueprint would peel off. And lo and behold, you would actually see a map these cards, and actually also worked with Monopoly playing, uh, Monopoly board games, saved thousands of prisoners' lives. They were escape routes of how to escape the prisoner of war camp. And again, thousands of prisoners escaped. This one is astounding. We're standing in front of a tank here, but not really. Not really. It's an inflatable tank known as the Ghost Army. Um, Normandy was going to happen. General Eisenhower knew they needed a diversion, and they created three fake regiments under General Patton under something called Operation Fortitude, and they created inflatable tanks, inflatable jeeps, uh, fake soldiers, and uh, radio traffic to completely dis detract Nazis and Hitler of what was going to do. They thought they were going to come over the English Channel. And even after the Normandy attack, Hitler still thought they were going to attack over the English Channel. And in the images we've seen in connection with this exhibition, um, after this information was declassified, you see them actually hold this up. We could hold this one up as well. Yeah, it just weighs a few pounds. From what I've read, um, the Ghost Army saved 30,000 Allied American lives, and it remained a secret until the late 1990s. This is extra special because this has just received uh, presidential and congressional attention. Yeah, in February of this year, uh, President Biden awarded those in the Ghost Army, they're about 1,100 soldiers, the Congressional Medal of Honor, so well deserved. More than 100 rare and unique stories and hundreds of artifacts are waiting for you to explore. In Simi Valley at the Reagan Library, Gail Anderson, KTLA 5 News.